Hey guys, good morning. So today is Friday. I am all puffy and swollen because I literally just woke up. I went out to Duncan, got a nice coffee. I don't know why I got a large. I meant to get a medium, but like when I started talking, I, I said a large, but I didn't need to get all this coffee, but obviously I'm gonna still drink it. I always just get regular iced coffee with almond milk, two sweet and lows. I go through phases. If you guys watch me, you know I'm not really a coffee drinker, but like sometimes I just go through like, let's say like a week or two where I'm just like, I wanna go out and I wanna get an iced coffee. And that's what I've been doing this week. I think because it's been so freaking hot here in PA that, by the way, my nails are so gross. I need to repaint them today. But it's been so hot and I feel like Dunkin' Iced Coffee, like lately, it's been really good and it's so refreshing. Sometimes I'll do Dunkin', sometimes I'll do Starbucks, but I don't know. I've been really enjoying Dunkin's. But right now I'm at Target actually because I want to get a couple of things. I need to get some eye drops. I went to Walmart and they didn't have the eye drops that I use. I use the Lumify eye drops, which help if you have like super, super red eyes. I'll show you guys what they look like. I talked about them before, but I'm also going to go get some wine. I'm going to go to one of my grocery stores and get some because you guys gave me like some really good suggestions on my Dollar Tree video and then also on Instagram. So I want to go see if there's any good wines. I'll post like the thing that I posted on my Instagram here. These were like the top wines that a lot of you guys recommended there's also apparently wine at aldi i don't have wine at my aldi i mean at least i've never i know i've never i would have seen it if there was a wine section there's literally no wine at aldi and apparently aldi has like some of the best wine so that's really interesting i wonder if it's like just my aldi that doesn't have it I've never heard of like Aldi having wine. Yeah, that's what I'm doing today. I also need to edit Sunday's new video because I already pre-filmed that. So that is the plan. But yeah, I'm about to head in and see what they have at Target. So let's get my mask. Okay, so I'm back home now. I actually need to go back out because I want to go get some of the wine that I told you guys about earlier. I think I told you that I wanted to try out some different wines based on your recommendation. But I wanted to come back because it stopped raining and I wanted to take Bernard on a walk. That's why I'm all sweaty and gross because he refuses to go out when it's raining. So I had to come back and take him out to go potty. And then I figured I would show you guys what I got from Target. I know, it's another haul. I feel like it wouldn't be a Juicy Jazz vlog without a haul. And somebody commented and they were like, all you do on this channel is do hauls. You don't even really vlog. And I'm like, please let me live. So the first thing that I got, which I'm so excited about, you guys, are these Clorox wipes. I have not been able to find these, obviously because of everything happening, like the pandemic, since March. I use these all the time, like even prior to the pandemic. I love these for cleaning the toilet and the sink specifically in the bathroom. They're just so good and I feel like you don't need to use a ton of wipes to get a good deep clean. I've tried a couple like plant-based wipes and I feel like they're just not as good. Like they don't disinfect anything. They're just like essential oils in them and I wanted something good. So that's why I always use Clorox and these are just the bomb and I was actually really surprised that they had a three pack like I also did get the method daily granite cleaner this I actually do like and this is a plant-based like cleaner and I think this is really good for countertops for every single day it smells really good and I like this a lot I also saw Nazanin Kavari talking about this by the way I'm a little jittery from coffee and that's why I don't like drinking coffee I'm done drinking it for the rest of the week because I'm like shaking a little bit i hate that i think it's because i got a large coffee i shouldn't have did that but anyways i got the thera breath fresh breath oral rinse i saw nazanin talking about this on instagram and i was like okay i need it i'm gonna get it i've actually seen a couple people talking about this but i trust her recommendations the most i also specifically went to target for the lumify eye drops and i was so happy to find them because i use these every single day i've talked about these before but if you have really red eyes for whatever reason these are really good all you need to do is one drop in each eye and they just instantly make like the whites in your eyes look super super white yeah that's pretty much oh no i got a couple other things I didn't get much um so I actually got these little hoops I've been loving Target's jewelry and these are super cute they're just like chunky gold hoops and these were eight dollars I also did get the silver version as well and then I got like a mini little silver version as well I love these when I went to Walmart I picked up the watercolors by color club it's a water-based nail color and apparently this is like a plant-based brand but like how cute is this nail polish I don't know why I'm like into painting my nails now but I've been loving it I also did pick up the Sally Hansen Omega Strength nail color this is like a really pretty 
nude like pinky shade this one is in 010 and then i also did get the mega strength hardener this doesn't really honestly last a super long time but i figured i would get it anyway just because i really like the color i'm wearing a sally hansen polish right now and i feel like it does chip really easily i don't know if it's the polish that i'm using or the top coat i also did get these little like moccasin like slippers i mean i don't think they're really slippers but they're like kind of moccasin likes and they were only 20 dollars from the brand stars above i am so ready for fall these like remind me of fall so I cannot wait. I'm over the heat. I'm just ready. Like I feel like once it's like the end of July, August, like I'm just over the heat. It's like too much. That's one of the reasons why I could never live somewhere where it's always hot out because I like the season changes. Um, but yeah, I'm ready for fall. So I got these. I figured, I mean, with anything, leggings, whatever you could always wear little moccasin like shoes and then i got this dress i don't know honestly if i'm going to like this or if it's gonna fit because the dressing rooms were closed so i might have to return it but i don't know i just thought it was kind of cute mm, i don't know we'll see we'll see how it fits i just got this in a size small and this was 25 dollars, so a little pricey so if it doesn't look good i'm definitely gonna return it but Got that. I also got like this little black dress. This was $12. Just like really basic. I thought this would be cute with like sandals. Maybe like my hair the way that it is now. And like some little like chunky hoops. I feel like that would be really cute. I also did get a bathing suit. And um, I have to go back so they can take this off. Because I went through like self-checkout. And I didn't even realize that this was on there. So that was my bad. Alright. We just got Chen. So... Let's see, we got our smoothies, mm -hmm. banana, pineapple, so good. You guys have to try this place here. Screenshot it if you're in the area. Please come here, thank us later. We're about to grub, and this will be gone in like five minutes. Okay, so. <laughs> yep, gossip girl on. A great time. I just wish that they would leave me alone. Oh, is that why you got your hair blown out? Yeah, I know. <laughs> mm. <laughs> okay, so I just got out of the shower and I wanted to shout out these pajamas because you guys they are the best pajamas I've ever put on my body. They're so comfortable and so soft. I just love them so much. So I got these at Target and I already have a stain on them because I spilled facial oil on them last week and they're clean. They're just stained like I tried to get it off and I feel like the stain got bigger honestly, but still love them. Still gonna wear them of course, but they are so comfortable. I'll put like a screenshot of them right here. I want every single color. I have this color and then I also have a baby pink which I just love. I want to get the black ones and the navy ones. I'm going to have to order them online though because when I got these in store these are the only two sizes that they had but the material you guys is just so incredibly soft and comfortable. I can't get enough of it but these are cute. They're just like little shorts and I just love them so yeah you need these don't look at that stain anyways i'm going to show you guys the wines that we got because we got some good ones hector already started drinking the wine that he gets it's like way too strong for me but i'll show you guys everything that we got okay so these are the wines that i ended up getting i couldn't find everything that was recommended i'm gonna have to go to like an actual like wine and spirits but i just ended up going to a grocery store today because i didn't feel like going to a wine and spirits today but this is what i got for now obviously not going to drink everything tonight it's going to just be for the next couple of weeks just to try out. I like to try out different wines on the weekends, but I got Barefoot Moscato, which was super popular. Um, I just got the big bottle because it was, I feel like a better deal versus getting the smaller one. So I picked that one up. This one is actually for Hector. This is really, really strong. I'm personally not a big fan of it, but he really likes it. The alcohol content on this is 18%. So be mindful. It says sweet, but I feel like, again, this is just so strong. I guess it's because of how strong the alcohol content is, but not a fan of that one, but I ended up getting this one for myself and then Briscato, which was another super popular brand. I really like the Clover Hill brand, so I figured I would try this specific wine out. So yeah, that is what I got. I think tonight, maybe I'll try this one out and see what it tastes like, or I might actually try Riscato because that was like super popular. And whenever I drink wine, I love having pretzels with it. So I just picked these up, which are really good. Let me see if Hector fell asleep. <laughs> Babe? Oh, you're still up. Shocked. He falls asleep usually really early. I'm gonna try one of the wines out. Let's try this one out. I really think this is gonna be dry wine. Not completely dry, it's a little sweet. It says clean, crisp finish. I agree. It's not like super sweet. I kinda don't really want that right now. Oh my gosh. Pretty good. It's pretty sweet. 
It's not super sweet, but it's good. Just first impression. I feel like this would be a good drink with like dinner. I don't know if it would be something that I could just have like just to relax. Ooh, Ooh that was easy. It's a lot smoother, which is good. All right, so I'm gonna have my glass of wine downstairs with Hector, relax. By the way, a lot of people were asking why our fridge comes out. So sometimes like when we pull it out, it like slides out or sometimes when I clean it and like open up this, it's just like easier for me, but we just forget to like push it in. How perfect is this? Food is good, wine is better. Got it at Home Goods, And this is our little wine cart, which I showed before. We got it from Amazon. It's so cute, has wheels and I just love it. So today is Sunday. Hector and I actually just got to Walmart. We wanna see if they have any bikes here because we've been wanting to get some bikes because we wanna ride them like in the park. And especially now that it's been so nice out and even in like the fall, we could always use them as well. So we're gonna see if they have them. I got my mask on. I'm gonna just use the Harry Potter mask. Bike time. See if they have any. Probably wiped out. <laughs> they might be wiped out. Okay, they are completely wiped out. <laughs> this one's pretty. That one looks nice. So these are the only three that they have, but not really feeling them. I want one like this, like with a basket. This one actually looks really good. They have different colors, but they are completely wiped out. They have a few kid bikes, but these are the only three that they have. I'm not really crazy about them just because they don't have baskets, so. Maybe we can find them online. Like if we look up the uh, the number, the item number. True. They might have them online. I want to try to find them one too. That one's crazy looking. I know, that's cool. Okay, so we came to a different Walmart and they actually have one of the bikes that I was looking at. And it's on sale, it seems. 124, that's not bad. I like the purple. I like it. Yeah. And it comes with the basket, which is what I wanted. I can dig it. Yeah, that one's nice. Hmm. Oh, that one's nice. Yeah, I was thinking about this. I want to take it out and look at it. Check it out. All right, we got the bikes. So I went with this one, the baby blue. It's a really pretty baby blue color. And then Hector got this bike, which is a mountain bike. And this one is a cruiser. And I really wanted one with a basket on the front. And this one also comes with a little cup holder, which I love. We got a good deal. Mine was 148, Hector's was 124. So not bad, that's pretty much exactly what we wanted to spend on bikes. So I'm excited. I think we're gonna ride them later and test them out. Break them in a little bit. You're excited. Oh my God, yeah, I can't wait. I know. I haven't rode a bike or had one in so long, so I'm excited. So I got this order in the mail and I'm so excited about it. These are new bandanas for Bernard and they are from a subscriber actually. This is her business, it's called Pooch Magnet. So she reached out to me on Instagram and she was gonna send me one with his name on it and I was like, girl, I would just support your business and order myself. Obviously, I'm so grateful for you guys to send me your things, but I always love supporting small businesses. She's in California. I believe she's in LA, I wanna say, but I will link it down below. She has the cutest bandanas and I, of course, wanted to support. And these are adorable and I love trying out different ones for Bernard. So these are the ones that I got. This one I'm obsessed with because it has Curious George on it. This one says positive vibes only, like, come on, how freaking cute is that? And then this one, I love just like red and it has little doggies on it, super cute. And then this one I thought was perfect for summer and she put his name on it, which is so nice, but has watermelon and fruit on it and stuff. So I love this one. I'm definitely gonna put one of these on him today. Hi, sweet boy, Bernard. You sunbathing, my love. Aw, Angel, I love you. So cute, I love him. So yeah, I just got done filming. My mom's about to come over. Actually, she's gonna bring the dog, Jojo. And I love seeing Bernard and Jojo together. They get along so well, it's so cute. And a lot of people think I don't talk to my mom because I don't really, I guess, talk about my mom all the time. My mom's pretty private. She doesn't love being on camera. But I see my mom and I talk to her every single day 
multiple times a day. But um, I wanted to show you guys this table that Hector finally started painting. It's like our little side table here for the living room. And I think I told you guys like months ago that he was gonna start painting it. But once it started getting nicer out, I don't wanna say we neglected the inside, but we just put a lot of things on hold. Like for instance, these, he's gonna change these this weekend finally. But we started doing more like yard work outside and we didn't really do much inside. But I wanted to show you guys this table. It's not done, but it's definitely looking a little bit better. And it's like my vision is coming to life and it's gonna match really nicely with the decor that we have in the living room. So I wanted to show you guys what it looks like. So he started doing it this weekend and it's obviously not finished. He still needs to finish it this week, but this is what it looks like. It was like a really light brown color and I just wanted it to be darker to match the other furniture in the living room. And this is what he used. And I like the way it's looking. It's like such a nice color and I think it's really gonna like tie everything together in the living room and then this is the top to the table so it's like a white marble and i think that's also going to be really pretty with the rest of the decor okay the bandanas adorable like how freaking cute is this one so this one's the one that says positive vibes only and um it's like reversible i think jojo's here is jojo here that's why he's distracted oh <gasps> Is Jojo here? Let's go see Jojo! Hi, Jojo! <laughs> I want you, Jojo! Yay! Jojo's here! Hi, baby! <laughs> so me and Hector are gonna end the night off by giving ourselves some pedicures. We're basically just gonna soak our feet. So I got this pedicure spa system from Walmart and this one is from Amazon. They're both really good, but the one from Amazon I like a little bit more just because the water heats up. The one from Walmart doesn't, but they're both really good. It's really relaxing just to soak your feet like regardless, but definitely recommend the one from Amazon. I will link both of them down below. Yeah, we just added some of these foot soaks. This one I got from Amazon and then this one I just got from Walmart. Lavender is our fave, so. Yeah, we're just gonna have a relaxing night. It smells so good. Lavender is our favorite. These are some essentials for me whenever I do my nails. I got these files from Amazon, and then I got this little scrubber from Walmart, and I think tonight I'm just gonna repaint my nails with the same polish that I already have on from Sally Hansen. This color is my favorite at the moment. It's 040 class act it's like a really pretty like bright red love that and then i just use this top coat because it does dry really fast and i wanted to shout out this foot file from amazon this is so good for removing dead skin on your heels and when you're done with it it literally feels like you just got a pedicure it's amazing you can like actually see the dead skin coming off of your feet it's like gross but really satisfying so i will link this down below this is always essential for me every time i give myself at-home pedicures and then i also got this little nail kit i got this from walmart and it's cute because it comes with like nail clippers and stuff for your cuticles so kind of like a little bit of everything and it was super affordable. All right guys, so that is it for today's vlog. I am gonna just wrap up and go to sleep, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for being here today. Don't forget to subscribe for more vlogs and I will see you very soon in my next one. Bye.